Hello, everybody. Welcome once again to Wednesdays with Larawana. Every Wednesday right here on Canawanabuy.com, we bring you the latest information on recreational and medical marijuana from all over the world. This week, we're going to talk about vaporizers. Many cannabis users prefer vaporizers over other ingestion methods like joints, pipes, and a new study helps explain why. This is from LeafScience.com. Last month, Whoopi Goldberg, a famous actress comedian, made her preference for the vapor pen clear in a column for The Cannabist. These pens are light, compact, and portable, the actress wrote. With the vape pen, you have more control over how much THC you ingest. Like Goldberg, marijuana smokers around the world are steadily switching to vaporizers. Proponents tout the harm reduction and health benefits of inhaling cannabis as vapor instead of smoke. Australian researcher John Malouf, PhD, set out to measure the advantages and disadvantages of vaporizing as identified by cannabis users. The study called Experiences of Marijuana Vaporizer Users was published this month and followed 96 individuals who began using vaporizers on their own initiative. Ultimately, participants in the study reported more positives than negatives about using vaporizers. In describing their experiences, study participants identified four consistent advantages to using vaporizers over other modes of intake. The advantages include perceived health benefits such as felt easier on my lungs and no more coughing up dust and tar, better taste or as one respondent states clean taste, no smoke or smell more discreet when using a vaporizer, also more effect for the same amount of marijuana. The most common disadvantages were inconvenience and difficulties in use including maintenance and cleaning and number two delay caused by setup. Dr. Malouf and his team also uncovered rather unique benefit of using a vaporizer. Mixing cannabis with tobacco was less common. Uh, that's something that they do a lot in Europe by the way. Uh, we asked participants whether they combined tobacco with marijuana in the vaporizer. Only two of 96 indicated that they did. He wrote, 15 respondents indicated that when they smoked marijuana, they mixed tobacco with it. The difference was statistically significant. Overall, 84 of the 96 study participants reported that they were satisfied or very satisfied with the vaporizer experience and 97.9% .9 said they intended to continue vaporizing cannabis. This preference for vaporizing cannabis is reflected in its growing popularity with marijuana users. An expanding market strives to meet this need, offering everything from inexpensive disposable pens to high-end desktop models that run in the price range of $500 to $700. And as legalization becomes a reality in many places around the globe, this demand will likely continue to grow. If vaporizers become more commonly used and competition among manufacturers increases, the vaporizer may come may become cheaper to buy and more convenient to use. A leading to a greater use, the study concludes, the results indicate that vaporizers are worthy of experimental research. Now I was uh, an old school uh, smoker for many many years and the vaporizers are very new to me. However, uh, I find that they are very good. Uh, you get our pure cannabinoids and THC without any of the other plant matter. Uh, give it a try. Canawana Buy has a couple of dozen great vaporizers, whether they be uh, desktop or the pen type vaporizers that you can take out with you. Give Canawana Buy a chance to send you the fast shipping and great prices that they offer for vaporizers. Again, that's CanawanaBuy.com. I'm your host, Larawana. We'll be back next week with Wednesdays with Larawana. Peace and love, everybody. Peace and love.